Hey everybody, Robert here, and tonight I'm going to teach you how to properly cut up an onion. So first we're going to start off and cut off both ends of the onion. We need to get this papery skin off. And uh, you'll see this off camera here because I'm a bad cameraman, but I'm going to make one slice in the side and peel off that outermost layer. Jeez, looking like a regular Guy Fieri with all those rings on my fingers tonight. So take the onion, cut it in half as the camera goes out of focus. And uh, first we're going to teach you how to dice. So you make a lateral slice into the side of the onion and then make a couple of vertical slices. So basically you're making like onion fingers as it were. Now, again, you see here, it's just real simple. You kind of slice on the edges here and that is what we call a dice, a dice. A chop would be a much less refined version of this. So that's good diced onion. You can see I'm gonna take what's left of the onion there, turn it on its side and dice that up as well. Got to clean off the blade here real quick and we'll move on to our next chop. If you've ever heard of Frenching an onion, I'm going to show you what a French onion is. So when you have French onion soup, this is the type of slice that you use. Very simple. Turn on its side. When someone says sliced onion, you cut it laterally like that. And then at the very end here, I just want to show you real quick. This is what we call a chop. So notice I just cut it in half and I just very quickly make a couple of quick slices. Now those are a little more uniform than you would expect, but it's just a nice clean cut. Now, if something asks for minced, then what you got to do is you got to take your pile here and continue to cut it up, really break it down. Now, some chefs will tell you to put a little salt on this and cut it up. I don't think it's necessary, but you just keep working it until you have a fine mince. Think like, you know, the onions they used to put on McDonald's hamburgers. And there you have it.